hello everyone welcome to another video in this video i will show you all the step-by-step -step procedures on how to set up cron jobs in linux what is a cron job a cron job is a linux command used for scheduling tasks to be executed sometime in the future also this is normally used to schedule a job that is executed periodically for example every 8 a.m every day of the week you have a particular message to send out to your employees instead of you sitting on your computer and typing up that message every 8 a.m every day you can set up a cron job that will be sending out those messages automatically for you you won't need to sit there and be typing messages up every day for better understanding watch the video from beginning to end but before i show you the video please if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel yet do well to subscribe when you subscribe don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that once i post another interesting video like this one in the days ahead you will be notified and be one among the first people to watch that video watch the video see you at the end the very first thing to do is to log onto your saver and SSH it into a terminal. When you SSH your server into a terminal, the next thing to do is to run the cron tab dash L to see cron jobs that I have on the system set up. Normally, as you can see on my system, I don't have any cron job set up on my system. The next thing to do, I will setting up the script which I want my cron job to run. So what I'll do is I'll do pwd, I mean slash root breeze demo. I mean root breeze demo. Let me do ls to see the files that I have on my system. I have just one file, cron.sh. So I will do vi into breeze.sh breeze.sh i want my cron to touch the file in slash root breeze demo touch the file call this file name is going to be demo dash breeze dash root this is the file name now I'll save and exit. Save and exit. If I do ls now, list. This is what we have. The next thing to do now, I'll be giving the file breeze.sh permissions so that my cron will be able to run to access that file. If I do long list, you see the permissions I have. What I'll do right now, I'll say she mode. I'll give it 766. Then I'll say breeze.sh. If I do long list now, you see that my file has some permissions. The next thing to do now is to set up the cron, the cron to run. So I'll cron tab dash e to edit the cron file. So the next thing to do, I'll put on, I'll first of all put in stars, then I'll tell you all what these stars represent. The very first star that I'm going to put in here represents, represents minutes. Give space, the next star represents R. The next star represents days, days of the month. The next one represents months of the year. And the next one represents days of the week. The next thing I'll do is I'll say go to slash root. This is the path to where the script is. Slash root, slash breeze, demo. And execute the file breeze.sh. Then at this point, I will come back over here. Make sure before setting up a cron job, confirm on your uh, on your server that your time and date are all correct. If not, your cron will run on a different date or different time. So the next thing to do, my time now is two fifty nine p.m. I will setting up my cron to run at every three minute. I will say every three minute of an hour. So this is how my cron is going to be every three minutes. Of every hour of every day of every month of every day of the week so every three minute of every hour this cron is going to run so I will save and quit if I do cron cron tab dash L dash L you're going to see my cron job which I've just set up right now if I do LS I have just two files on the system so let's wait for the time to reach for our front to run. Okay, it's time. Let's do ls again to see. ls. You see, our cron has been executed. The command has been executed. So this is the file that has been created. So this is how to set up a cron job in Linux for it to run or to execute whatsoever script you want it to execute. Welcome back. I hope you enjoyed the video just watch right now. Please, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel yet, do well to subscribe. Please, 
it doesn't cost you anything to subscribe to the subscription button when you subscribe don't forget to turn on the notification bell so that once i post another video in the days ahead which i'm about to post you will be notified by youtube and you'll be one among the first people to watch that video please don't also forget to like share and comment drop a comment at the comment section as your comment will help me to improve in my content creating skills and it will also help me to give me the courage to keep creating more content like this one in the days ahead also if you have a particular video you want me to create drop the the, the, the title of the video at the comment section and i'll create that video for you stay tuned and stay blessed